Com for more details. Well, folks, we are live, of course, on this. Is it Saturday today? Friday, you see, I have no clue. It's Friday. Um, I will tell you that exciting things are afoot behind the scenes since, of course, we uh, sold out of our today's special a little bit early. Uh, the folks are working very hard to find a replacement for the next hour. We don't know what it's going to be, but I will let you know when our producer Rick knows. In the meantime, very excited to showcase this. Okay, let me just start by saying, having the honor as the number one selling kitchen appliance ever, number one selling brand and pressure cooker that we've ever featured, over a thousand reviews, and quite honestly, the one appliance that every single kitchen in America needs. I know I'm, I'm kind of preaching to the converted to many folks that already have one and have tried it. That pressure cook taste that melts in your mouth is unrivaled. Here's what we've got tonight. $99 and change for our biggest and most powerful and most advanced pressure cooker. Reduced shipping and handling of only $9 and change and a crazy five flex while supplies last. I only have about a thousand in each color. That is black, that is red, that is white. The lovely Kelly Deirdring is here. She is our pressure cooker advocate and ambassador. Kelly, you know I'm kind of wild about this, as is everybody on HSN. But we all buy appliances and they always end up on the top of the cupboard in the kitchen. Oh, this won't. Not this. This will be on your countertop. Here's the thing. If you've never done pressure cooking, just hang out with us for the next 20 minutes because I really want to talk to you because I was you just a few short years ago. I'd never pressure cooked. I thought pressure cooking was way advanced, like way above my pay grade in the <laughs> kitchen because I'm not a chef. Right. I don't have any culinary training. I just love, I consider myself a very good home cook. I'll say that. I think I cook well, but this makes me me cook amazing food. Three reasons, in my opinion, why pressure cooking is unbelievable. Number one, it's faster. We'll talk about those times. It's about 60% faster. Um, number two, it's a more nutritious way to cook. Yeah. And I will get into that. Yeah. But three, and most important, the flavors, as Adam mentioned, yeah. are out of this world. There's nothing like pressure cooked food. Now, Elite brings to us an eight quart pressure cooker for the price you would pay for any other six quart pressure cooker mm -hmm. on the market. Six quart pressure cookers are about 100 bucks plus about 15 20 bucks shipping just just do a quick online yep. search that's yep. what you're gonna pay this one has a digital brain it's essentially a supercomputer built into the front of your pressure cooker so you don't have to get out a calculator you don't have to do mathematics you don't have to or have automatic. a calculus major you press ribs you press pork you press rice yep. okay it's all pre-programmed that's why people choose elite over even the chef brands you know the ones that are branded with the chef names people choose elite because because ours is pre-programmed. Right. All right, we're gonna get into the food. Okay. Because you told me you were hungry. I'm starving. Okay. Starving. Ready for this? Yes. Two full-sized rack of ribs. Yeah. Okay. Full on, right in my pressure cooker. Ask me how long. How long did the ribs take? Thank you for asking. Most of the time, what would you say? Nine hours, 10 sure. hours for ribs? 45 minutes. 45 minutes. 40, 45 minutes to the most juicy, tender, there we go. flavorful now ribs business that literally up. fall off the bone. Do you see that bone? Oh, I see it. Peeling out of the ribs. Adam, you don't even have to chew. No. Because it is going to be so moist, so tender, in your mouth. so filled with flavor, melt in your mouth. Mouth, it gives it a whole nother meaning because look at what you get when you pressure cook your ribs okay you're gonna get meat that literally pops and bursts with flavor but it's gonna be so moist that you're not gnawing on the bone in fact all you need is a couple of forks to peel apart the rib meat look Gosh. at that that's what you get with pressure cookers that's why people it's kind of a little secret in the right. rib world right. they pressure cook their ribs they might throw them on the grill for a little smoke flavor at the end, right. maybe 10 minutes. They pressure cook their ribs on those rib competitions because everybody wants moist, juicy, tender meat. That's how you get it in a pressure cooker. Most people don't realize that. Guys, I, I, I just want to quickly say something and I don't want to interrupt this presentation. I did just get word they have uh, dealt with an organizer this day only. 
I, I'm not allowed to say anything, but I will tell you that Debbie Meyer has not left the building. They are bringing her back. It's <laughs> I thought I'd say goodbye. She's coming back. So if you missed out on the Debbie Meyer Today special, stick around. I'm yet to find out exactly what the offer is going to be, but apparently it's going to be a huge opportunity. Okay, can I have some of this now? I, please, Adam. Thank I you want that. you to try this because, honest to goodness, there is nothing better than pressure cooked ribs. Oh, Here's a big forkful. Oh, thank that you. That forkful is for you, sir. You're spoiling me. Yes, I am. And I want you to tell me how that tastes because most people have never tried it. They it's almost hard to explain to somebody that's never had pressure cooked food what pressure cooked food tastes like, why there's a difference. <laughs> exactly. I love asking the host with their mouthful, you know, to explain it. But it's it's almost as if I can't explain it to you. You have to try it for yourself, and I want you to try it for yourself. Best ribs you've ever tried in your it, life. It, it really is. It really is going to be some of the best ribs you've ever tried. It, the, here's the problem that I always have, and I always I feel the same when I watch TV. When the host says, "Now I've got this, and I use this, and I love this," and then the ho you hear the person say it a couple times, you think, "Yeah, do they really?" Mm -hmm. Folks, I really have I know this. He does. Chelsea has this exact one in the black. We use our pressure cooker all the time. The thing that I love the most is brisket. Chelsea makes a mean brisket sandwich. Whether you love ribs and we're going to do everything you could possibly imagine, it is the most used kitchen appliance I've ever purchased, mm -hmm. and I would recommend it to anyone. The reason why they're selling so quickly tonight, quite honestly, beyond my ooing and ahhing over the ribs, is because the price is so low. At $99, reduced shipping and a crazy five flex pay. So if you've ever been tempted by it, if you've read some of the nearly 2,000 reviews online, I mean, Kelly, people, are not, it's not just me. Everybody no, so wants over 1,200 people, this is 1,200 individual humans yeah. who don't know each other, have decided that this pressure cooker is perfect. That's They've given hard. it five stars. Here's why. I want to go down to this digital brain right down front. This is essentially a computer built into your pressure cooker. Ready for this? This is why people choose this one. It has menu options built in, 13 of them in fact. Preheat or reheat, beans from dry in 14 minutes, brown rice in 23 minutes, white rice in 10 minutes, uh, that's wild rice in 25 minutes, stew in 18 minutes, poultry from frozen FYI uh -uh. in 20 minutes, no. pork and ribs in 30, soup in 16 minutes, beef in 26, potatoes not not an hour in your oven anymore. We're talking 12 minutes to the most beautiful baked potato. Desserts in 20, vegetables and fish in five minutes. And then there's a delay timer. So I can set this to come on tomorrow up to 24 hours in advance. And what's really cool about this machine is that once it's done pressure cooking, it automatically switches to keep warm. So it doesn't overcook your food. Ever. I have not met a pressure cooker that does that. Mm -hmm. This is so feature rich for the price. I've, I'm, not I'm not kidding you. Look online. Just yep. do do me a favor, don't order it yet. Look online, Compare. just real quick. Six quarts, 120 bucks, not all day long. Yep. That's what you're gonna find, yep. and they're not pre-programmed, and you have to do mathematics, and you have to be a chef to know how to use them. Not with this. Look at this, okay? Just look at it. It's a this thing of beauty is, right there. <laughs> this is eight quarts of ooey gooey, perfectly cooked, gorgeous mac and cheese, better than any mac and cheese you've ever tried. This was done in 11 minutes, Adam. So I know that a lot That's of food. you are probably thinking, well, I can do mac and cheese on my stovetop or in my oven. I, You know, you have to get out the pot and take it to a rolling oh, boil and you. get out your noodles and get out your strainer and do X, Y, and Z. It might take you 30, 45 minutes and six or seven pots and pans to make your mac and cheese. Guess what? 11 minutes. Mm from